to Los Angeles, California. So I'm currently here at the Santa Monica Pier, the famous Santa Monica Pier. To go into the Santa Monica Pier, there's no fee. All you have to do is pay for parking, which was $7 for the whole day. Here at the Santa Monica Pier, you'll find a variety of things to do. There's a Ferris wheel, there's a roller coasters, there's a lot of restaurants where you can come here and eat. On the boardwalk itself, there's a lot of music performances, a lot of people trying to sell photos, pieces of art, and let's not forget about the Santa Monica Beach. <laughs> that the Santa Monica Pier has to offer. There's always one thing that you can do, and that's take a dip in the beach. here at the Griffith Observatory in Griffith Park up in the mountains in Los Angeles. The Griffith Observatory is an exhibit of a whole bunch of solar system models inside like eclipses, moons, sun. To go inside of the exhibit is free. You have to pay for parking though which is four dollars an hour. Also inside of the exhibit you can look out of a few telescopes that point up to the sky. But I think the main reason that people come here to the Griffith Observatory is for the view. You get a clear 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 look at the Hollywood sign and the Los Angeles skyline. of all time is the rapper Drake. Uh, I am currently at his OVO store here in Los Angeles. So I'm currently at the Grove right now here in Los Angeles. This is uh, an outdoor shopping center and it is very, very, very nicely decorated. So 
I'm currently at this place, which uh, I don't really know if it has a name, but this is a road here in Los Angeles of Salvadoreños, handmade food, homemade food right on the side of the street. I know this probably doesn't make sense, but let me just show you what I'm talking about. This little spot has all of your traditional Salvadorian slash Central American foods like riguas, pupusas, horchata, pastelitos, yuca. Everything is homemade and made right in front of you. I mean, this spot is truly, truly, truly amazing. If you really want to get a feel for Central American food here in Los Angeles, you absolutely need to come to this spot. This uh, outstretched road of Central American food it starts from James M. Wood and Vermont all the way through James M. Wood and Westmoreland. around in this area I actually found the name for this place hey como se llama hermano aquí se llama el mercadito salvadoreño man everybody know this is the salvadorian the best salvadorian food in LA el mercadito salvadoreño you know permon y chesgu man so like my man said this place is called el mercadito salvadoreño you have to come check this place out it is awesome So I'm currently here at the very famous Staples Center, home of Kobe Bryant. Just joking, uh, but Kobe Bryant did play for a very, very, very long time for the uh, Los Angeles Lakers, which is the professional basketball team, along with the uh, Los Angeles Clippers and the women's basketball team, Los Angeles Sparks, and the national hockey team, Los Angeles Knights. Right next to the uh, Staples Center is the LA Convention Center, which hosts things like Comic Con, car shows, or other types of display exhibits going on here in Los Angeles. So, uh, randomly spread out across Los Angeles, you're gonna find uh, taco trucks. Uh, these have authentic Mexican tacos along with other dishes as well. So I was in Los Angeles for a total of five days and LA is such a huge city and I recorded a whole bunch of content that I can't just fit into one single video or else it'll be a really, really long video. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to split Los Angeles into two videos. I will be posting part two of the Los Angeles video at a later time. I still have to show you guys uh, Hollywood, Dodger Stadium, Beverly Hills and a whole bunch of other places that I went to while I was in LA. 
Go ahead and drop a like on this video if you're excited for part two of Los Angeles. Like always, all of my social media links will be down in the description below of this video. Please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I have a whole bunch of cities that I still have to go to that I want to share with you guys. Feel free to share this video across all your social media platforms. And I'll see you back here in Los Angeles for part two of this video.